Hello friends, my name is Ramsu. Today we shall discuss about topic payment switch. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting, especially if you have interest in uh, in technology and you want to learn about it. So let's start, friend. First of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well, so that my videos can reach to you. And also, you can follow me on the Facebook page as well. Friend, payment switch. So basically, we are talking about uh, application or software application which is used in payment methods payment processing so now uh, let's let me give an example like uh, payment switch basically we all knows in any uh, banking industry or financial institutions they have a core banking system core banking system means or CBS which basically have all the information about customer accounts uh, and where they have to do the debit where they have to do the credit so if you just see this figure here the uh, there are so many channels like for example uh, we have a pause application like this okay we have a mobile application we have the ATMs so transactions can be performed from any channel like pause ATM mobile internet banking and this transaction will reach to the banking switch okay and then banking switch will after processing it it will provide it to the core banking system now here is the question that what is the purpose of payment switch and why not transfer the uh, transaction directly to the core banking system basically friend what happened that core banking system is uh, having the all the information related to customers accounts okay so they don't want to do this extra type of processing they want that banking switch okay it will manage all the transactions whether it is coming from pause whether it is coming from mobile internet banking ATMs so it will be uh, arrived on the banking switch banking switch will check whether the transaction is valid or not uh, whether the, there is any problem in authorization whether there is any problem in the uh, any uh, like for example if there is any fraudulent activity if there is any transaction uh, amount is not correct etc so all the verification will be done here okay and after processing it will be provided to the bank so that bank can take the uh, right action on the the CBS basically core banking system will take the right action so basically banking uh, the payment switch is basically a bridge between different channels whether uh, the transaction from where it is coming and the core banking system where it has all the customer accounts information if we talk about the step by step process it accepts the uh, the payment switch accept the validated transaction request from the payment gateway comply it with the guidelines to begin the transaction identify the payment service provider for that particular transaction and based on a bin allotment for the certain psp linked with the that payment request it then proceed to route the transaction finally it completes the transaction based on its success or a failure so this is the uh, step by step process uh, payment switch basically restructure the transaction success rate by dynamically routing payment transaction between the acquirer and the payment service provider they enable the expansion of payment network by supporting the integration of numerous PSPs in international acquirers due to encrypted bin allocation payment switches are secure and eliminate the risk of fraud payment switches also have fewer outage issues ensure that a transaction is completed successfully and all payments are processed in real time in just a matter of seconds between the point points of customer interaction and the processing system here it is very important that uh, the payment switch always process the trade transaction in real time that it is there is no concept that transaction will be parked somewhere and then after some time it will be processed it is not the case in the payment switch okay uh, okay friends so i hope you like this video if you like it please share it with the friends and colleagues and thanks a lot for watching the video thank you friends